1956 Ford van. Got the great mother's livery on it, or the tempo. Look at this, gorgeous car. Now, if you'll notice on the rear quarter panel, there is a chip on this car. I bought it loose off of eBay, and there's a chip on it. So it's been dropped, or something's been dropped on it. And what I notice is, is it looks like that's got gray primer underneath that chip, which is interesting. Or it could be Zamek, I don't know. But, nevertheless, that's, that's a chip that is not tempo. That is not a place where you put your gas in it. Got the black and white stripes on the side. Got the beautiful red color of the van. And then got the black on the top. Half and half black and red. Got the huge motor coming out the front there. Gorgeous car. Now, Mothers was a, or is a car wax company that in 2003, when you bought a bottle of car wax to shine your car with, you would get a Chip Foose Carson Lev design Mothers Hot Wheels. How neat is that? I got one when I was buying car wax one day. I got I actually got the shifter cart version. I got the cart, go-kart. And it's really neat as well. I'll bring it to you one of these days. Now, what's interesting about this particular 56 van from Ford is it's got an opening hood. Now, this particular, this particular model, and I don't want to push it, that's as far as that hood will open on this particular Hot Wheels. I went ahead and bought another one off of eBay but I haven't taken it out of the package yet to see if that hood will flip a little further open. I suspect it will, but I don't want to push it and break it. So I've just left it down. Unfortunately, I can't show you the motor under these conditions. But look at those mag wheels. Got the five spoke mag wheels. Got the chrome running board. Windows rolled down. Take a look at it from that angle. Got the dual exhaust on there. Got Foose design on the back door, got the dual windows in the back, got the double doors in the back. Really cool old van. Look at that. This thing looks great from practically any angle. Let's bring it around a little bit more. Yeah. It's almost, it's almost bothersome to have that, that hood like that. And You know, as much as I want to look at the motor, I'm almost of the mindset, you know, if you can't get the fit and finish better than that. Just don't do it. Don't do it. So it's kind of an unfortunate design decision there because I'd rather just have it just one solid piece, but Hot Wheels felt like they could pull it off and apparently they didn't, but that's okay. It's still a great looking van. In some circles, they call this F100, just like the F100 pickup truck. That I don't know if it's officially an F100 or what it is. But what I do know is it's modeled really well. The tempo is really nice on it. You can see the dual seats in front there. Got the big motor with the big intake, probably a supercharger on it. Look at that. Very detailed interior. Let's see if I can see. Yeah, chrome steering wheel. Very cool. Very, very cool. Don't have anything on the roof couple of other vehicles I got have the mother's logo on the roof. Nothing on the roof of this one. Let's take a look underneath and see what we've got underneath. Okay. 56 Ford and then made in Malaysia. Well modeled underneath on this. I think that's black plastic there. I mean, excuse me, not black. Gray plastic. It's got the Dual exhaust, got dual mufflers on it, got the drivetrain, got the differential, got the drive shaft, got the transmission, axles. It's well modeled. It's just, it's modeled as well underneath as it is on top. So that's saying a lot, especially for a Hot Wheels, because a lot of times they don't do a lot with the underside of one of these vehicles. Just a fantastic looking little van little delivery van and it's a two-door very cool very cool hope you liked it don't forget to like and subscribe have a great day